uh, Jay, thank you everybody that came out tonight to perform, and thank you everybody that supported me. Even if you need, thank you for supporting. All right, so I had I wrote something down today. You know, I like to write stuff down on a, on a uh, when I first think about it, and I, I came across a post that says trust the process. Okay, and I was battling with a couple things up in here, and as you know, I'm still unemployed. And I don't know why. I am a great, great employee. However, I know that I'm supposed to be a boss. So let me get to work. This poem is called Trust the Process and Progress. Open your eyes during this period of track. Bright lights, even machines, to a mother or parent you are handling. Trust the process. You are to be fed what they feed. Believe what you see and sacrifice your every belief. Trust the process. You are to be stripped from your childhood to be great, broke, persecuted, and all. And smile as, as if nothing happened and go shopping for clothes, candy, or video games at the mall. Trust the process. You are to be educated to be slaves and create neighborhood games and turn race against race to stray away from the Big Bang. Trust the process. You are, for, you are to forget your ancestral history and believe in the religious mysteries of incest, inbred, pedophilia, and hypocrisy. Trust the process and progress. Now open your eye during this period of travel. The wrath of Van New, aka Theos, aka Thanos, part of the sun growth forming a vortex that their, that their bloodline just can't handle. Trust the process and progress. Terraforming the atmosphere, the mothership of planet Nibiru is so near. Reconfiguring our DEA and metaphysical abilities with the solar flare. Trust the process and progress. Polar ice caps melting, cyclones, volcanoes, earthquakes, and heat waves. Factories, churches, labs on fire, we are digging in deep graves. Trust the process and progress. You sacrificed and killed for fear, children, blood, labor, and organs, to name a few. And the ones who look like me, trust, we won't forget about you. How you are a ship, ship, and pu puppet master. And with the 13 bloodlines, you are through. Trust the process and progress. With one snap, the wrath of Van New welcomes you to this new era in travel. We, where we are given what's rightfully ours, and we orchestrate the battle, mm -hmm. revealing how all along this world, we are how all along in this world we are worth more than live, livestock and cattle. We must trust the process and progress of the universe's ancestors to dismantle. It's the spirit. It's the spirit. It's the spirit that they just can't handle. So trust the process and progress. So that was the first um, poem. Second one is called Undress Your Body. Nothing but sight to sit and observe the mass destruction of life. To see with my eyes, ingest in my mouth, soak in my skin, and absorb through my brain like a knife. Undress the politics, governments, democracy, and all systems of its power. Return all trust, land, and assets to assist with the upcoming sunshine. Undress that society's reality is economically fake and false, causing disastrous friction. From mass production of prescriptions that cause addiction to Hollywood's mass subscriptions. Undress the taste of the flesh and blood that's been systematically stationed in every nation. Human traffic can turn into real estate, politics, social media ads, and TV stations. Undress your builders and machines, technologies, and laser beams. Accept the realization of fellow galaxies and the galactic cosmic supremes. Undress your prison systems for the lies, destructions, corruption, and false accusations. They're destroying some of the brightest minds and spirits, accusing them of rape, murder, and molestation. Undress these celebrities. Some actually want to be free. 
They want to publicly express that he is really she. And if you pay attention, they scream so heavily through their music interviews and fellow conspirators will start to sing. Address the conspiracies and myths. Go down the rabbit hole and explore. Unlearn, unlearn, unlearn again to recharge, regain, and restore. Address your reality of anything that's fake, artificial, and cause strife. Address the lies, hurt, and hardship, and pain to have access to your new life. Undress the feelings of fear, panic, trepidation, and fright. Now, gain feelings of calmness, confidence, and love, then take flight. Undress the experience fabrication of deceit to be vindicated, not persecuted, oppressed, and despised. Reality is now, we have to unite, claim our power, and join the new uprise. So undress your body. Thank you. And as always, this is bigger than black and white. I speak beyond race. The next one is called Close Your Eyes, Now Wake Up. Close your eyes and go on a journey with me. Imagine we were all asleep, still fighting to get free. Imagine spiritually, we were fed up of our lives to capitalize like what to eat, what to wear, and what gender we are inside. Like divide and conquer is the only way to socialize and survive. Like how Black Lives Matter, Obama taught us how to demonize, monetize, and cobalize. Close your eyes. Imagine watching TV, movies, celebrities, basically your politician, being everything you've envisioned. Just your modern day magician. Imagine everything that was true was actually fiction and addiction. And children and families are auditioning for a religion or a specific position, only to find out that they are the ones actually missing in this position, turning men into women in this industry that we call catfishing. Close your eyes. Now wake up. Wake up to the reality that truth starts with it. True wealth, laws of nature, coded in your DNA when we begin. Wake up to the reality that we will unite and set free. Wake up to Mother Nature reversing the negative in all ways for us. Wake up to entities like me, PEP, Rashad Jamal, Adama Speaks, Dick Gregory, and Doc, Dr. Sutton. Yaki Awaken, BB, B Dell 1014, Dr. York, Bob Hemet, and 19 Keys. Wake up to the earth, our ancestors and nature rising as they are surely pleased with me. Wake up and stop fantasizing, this is not a dream. Wake up and claim your name, land, and sovereignty, plus your crown. So close your eyes and go on a journey with me. Now wake up. Thank you, thank you. All right, now this last one is called Invest in Life. I'm also a spiritual life coach as well as a business life coach for free because I ain't getting paid yet. I'm looking at y'all. However, one thing that I choose to remind my clients of, uh, I hate saying clients, my people of, uh, excuse me, because we learn from one another. So if you will, with me real quick, sorry, I know I'm wasting time, on your hands, in your personal life, how many people have passed away? Okay, and you can do it in your head as well. But then I want you to count your close friends and your business partners and your co-workers. Count those people that have passed away. And now I want you to count your celebrities, your politicians, your religious leaders, your military leaders. Now count how many of them have passed away. So I think it's time that we invest in life. And this next poem is called Invest in Life. Traveling through this world can hold a heavy burden to some. It's a choice. It's a choice that we chose. Cycles to break, laws to reverse, using our minds unmasked, exposed. To observe, corporations take away liberation, freedom, and life from the dead. To observe, killing and stealing is actually what makes the multi trillion, including the parents that sell their children. To witness the illegal and prescription take position. Then their bloodlines make money, finally saying, be holistic. Did I mention the pain the earth is feeling from these decisions? Invest in life in the natural laws of nature, producing life. 
the ancestors, mother kind, and the universe will not think twice. March 23rd is the new cycle of life. So you got maybe about seven years to get this right. Supreme, supreme beings continuously rise while others slowly wait, tearing off their disguise. And the earth is rapidly cleansing, so don't be surprised. You can't run, you can't hide. The wind, water, and fire, nature knows exactly where you reside. We're on to you no matter how you mess the times. We are divine, using our minds to, decap to decapitate a worldly God. Six thousand years, get back this rightfully mine. Invest in your life in the positive within. Invest in Mother Nature, no death corporations. Invest in me and my vision. Invest in generational wealth. Invest in your new position. Invest in your health. Invest in no governing parties taking leads. Invest in your death if you follow artificial greed. Invest in your history and whatever that may be. And when you find out who you are, handle that respectfully and with peace. Invest in the school system that will teach our children to embrace their inner abilities without taking them to your labs and bunkers as your case studies. Because we are not asking, we are telling invest in life and push peace. No portals, no planes, no, no rockets, because in this realm you will decease. So invest in life. Okay, so thank you so very much. I'm going to turn around real quick. I don't need to turn my back to you all, but I need we are nothing without our voices. We are nothing standing alone. Coming up. 